All right, that's that's what we're going to change it. All right, so first things first, Kansas City Chiefs are Super Bowl contenders. Okay, the next team that I believe can make a run to the Super Bowl again is the Philadelphia Eagles. I believe the Philadelphia Eagles will make a strong push this year to uh, the Super Bowl again. As the they're probably going to win the East again for sure. Um, but yeah, these are my two Super Bowl contenders. I also have one more as well, which is San Francisco 49ers. Brock Purdy stepped up big last season, filling out for, uh, what's his name? Jimmy Garoppolo. Jimmy Garoppolo is on the Los Angeles, Las Vegas Raiders now. But I think Brock Purdy could do a, a nice push. Okay. So these are my three Super Bowl contenders, unbiased opinion. This is who I see going far, okay? Um, I'm gonna have to put another team up there, dude. Uh, no Rams? No, no, no Rams, no Rams, no Rams. I, I hate this, but Buffalo Bills are in win-now mode. Um, they're having a lot of problems, maybe. That's what I heard with Josh Allen and Stefan Diggs. But, you know, that's all talk. Believe it or not, the Buffalo Bills are Super Bowl contenders. I have to put them up there as well. So these are my four teams that I see making it to the Super Bowl. This is unbiased, Kel. Okay? Of course, I see the Miami Dolphins being a Super Bowl team. If Tua stays healthy, we're a Super Bowl caliber team. The Miami Dolphins are a Super Bowl caliber team if we stay healthy. All right. Playoff hopefuls. Um, playoff hopefuls. All right. Unbiased playoff hopefuls for sure. I feel like we make a big step. We could make a deep run. But I truly, truly believe we can make it to the Super Bowl. But I'll put the Dolphins here at playoff hopes. Ten wins. You know? Um, another playoff hopefuls, uh, New York Jets. Um, I feel like three AFC East teams are going to make it to the playoffs, dude. That's how I feel. I feel like three. I feel like the New York Jets have Aaron Rodgers now, but they missed the playoffs. The New York Jets have Aaron Rodgers now, but they missed the playoffs. Go in order of teams instead. Of, okay, so I start with the Bears. Chicago Bears. Bears, the Bengals. Okay, I feel you. All right. Chicago Bears. They were ass last season. Chicago Bears were ass. Let's check their uh, NFL uh, records last year. Um, yeah. Chicago Bears last season were 3-14. And I think they're going to stay down there this year. <laughs> Sorry, Bear fans. Yeah, they were the worst team last season. Um, Jalen Hurts is cool. Uh, Jalen Hurts was cool. Um, but, you know. I, I, don't, I don't think they're going to be anything. Like I said, this is very early. Right? This is just my, uh, this is just how I feel going into the season. Anyway, let's move on because we got a lot of teams left here. Um, Cincinnati Bengals. Joe Burrow just got hurt, um, in training camp. Uh, yeah, they'll do better. They might get six wins, so. Mediocre? <laughs> six to four wins? <laughs> six to four wins. 
draft already happened, yeah. Joe Burrow got hurt uh, yesterday or two days ago. Uh, depending on the calf, dude. Depending on the calf. How bad the calf is. I don't know how long he's going to be missing out. Um, I think... Uh, I think they missed the playoffs now. I feel like... I feel like they're going to drop off now. Joe Burrow's hurt already. Um, I feel like Baltimore will do better than um, Cincinnati this year. I feel like... I'm going to say uh, Cincinnati is going to be... Uh, yeah, here. Alright, the Denver Broncos. They just signed Pan uh, uh, Sean Payton as a new head coach. With Russell Wilson. Russell Wilson was horrible last year. Nice. Tacos are fire, bro. Um, Russell Wilson was horrible last year. Right? He was horrible. I still think they're going to be mediocre. I don't think Sean Payton finds a way here. I don't know. Um, is Okay, yeah. I feel like the Broncos are going to... Especially with Kansas City and the Chargers in the same division. Hi, how are you? What's up, Simba? How you doing, bro? We're just talking about football, my boy. Hope you're having a great night over there across the pond. You know what I'm saying? Welcome in, welcome in. Uh, we're just doing a football tier list, my very early football predictions. All right, the Cleveland Browns. Is Deshaun Watson playing the whole season? Deshaun Watson hasn't played football for, like, forever. So, I'm going to give the Browns maybe seven wins missing the playoffs. I'm good, bro. How you doing, man? I'm glad you're stopping by, bro. I appreciate that. So, I give the Bengals nine to seven wins for sure. Or the Browns, yeah. All right. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Tampa Bay Buccaneers have Baker Mayfield as their quarterback, starting quarterback. Uh, no more Tom Brady. Um, I think they drop off. They drop off a lot here in uh, the NFC South. That's how I feel like. So I'm going to put them at mediocre. Just because I don't trust Baker Mayfield. Baker Mayfield, if you ever watch this, uh, no disrespect to you, brother. I'm I'm sorry. You know, I know you're a, you're a dog. You know what I'm saying? Um, but I just feel like uh, Tampa Bay will not get it done. Arizona Cardinals. Kyler Murray. Um, they lost DeAndre Hopkins. Um, Kyler Murray is still... Uh, I think they're the worst team in the league. The Arizona Cardinals. J.J. Watt is gone. Um, I think the Arizona Cardinals are the worst team in the league. Right next to the Houston Texans. Um, can Kyler Murray do it? I don't think so. I'll give them four wins, though. We'll see how they go. The Los Angeles Chargers... Justin Herbert just got the $135 million bag. He's a paid man now. But he has not won a playoff game. That's their choice. But I think the LA Chargers make it into the playoffs with the Dolphins. Welcome back, Kel. Welcome back, brother. We're just uh, doing some tier listing now. Um, The starting quarterback for the Indianapolis Colts... Is it Matt Ryan still? Now, the thing with the Indianapolis Colts, right? The Indianapolis Colts. Yeah, it's the Washington Commanders. It's the Commanders. Yeah, it's the Washington Commanders. So listen, on paper, the Colts are a stacked team. On paper. 
All right, they had one. Of, they had the best running back in the league. Uh, their receiving core did pretty good. Their defense is hella stacked. Matt Ryan, they have Matt Ryan, but they couldn't get it done last year. I personally just don't see them doing good, man. But I'm in between these guys. I'm I'm in between the Colts and mediocre playoffs missing the playoffs for sure mediocre I think they get seven wins I'm gonna put them up here I think they get seven wins the Washington Commanders um is Tyler Heineke the starting quarterback if uh Tyler Heineke's the starting quarterback I like that I like that a lot let's find out we'll check the players Sam Howell quarterback or did Tyler Heineke leave I need like a death chart dude let's go to ESPN we gotta go to ESPN NFL cuz I need to look at the roster too okay Washington commanders right here death chart all right, Sam Howell is the quarterback. Who is this, a rookie? No, he's not even a rookie, dude. Oh, man, this is... They have my boy Jacoby Brissett, but they have Sam Howell starting quarterback. Listen, I don't know anything about this kid. They're going to get four wins. <laughs> Sorry, brother. I'm like... <laughs> No, they made it to the playoffs last season, though. Look, they, they have Terry McLaurin. It's pretty good. Um, Curtis Samuel's pretty good. Chase Young is a beast. Kendall Fuller's pretty good. Like, their team's pretty good, dude. And they made it to the playoffs last year, but... The quarterback situation... Damn, this is a... Look, oh, they had a thousand yard receiver last year. Terry McLaurin was fire. I I think they're not the suck so much team. I think they get four wins for sure. The Dallas Cowboys, America's football team. Um, this is it for Dak Prescott. I feel like they don't have Ezekiel Elliott unless he resigned. But the Dallas Cowboys are a playoff team for sure. They are a playoff team. They're not as good as the uh, the Philadelphia Eagles, but they're better. They're better than most of the rest of the teams here, for sure. I see them making the playoffs. Um, they're not winning the Super Bowl. Probably. The Atlanta Falcons kill your team. We got to check them out real quick because... We got to check them out, bro. I got to look at the roster real quick. Uh, Atlanta Falcons. All right, they have Marcus Mariota, right, as their starting quarterback? <clears throat> Desmond Ryder. Desmond Ryder. All right, Desmond Ryder last season has 708 yards, two touchdowns. They have Tyler Heineke, dude. That's good. I like Tyler Heineke, dude. <laughs> I like Tyler Heineke. <laughs> They're starting DN. Calais Campbell is out already. Oh, man. Uh, Desmond Ryder is the starter. It says... Over Tyler Heineke. Damn. Damn. 
Do these guys even get four wins? They get four wins. Come on, they don't suck that bad. Maybe. <laughs> they do, though. Fuck. All right, the New York Giants, dude. New York Giants had a great run last year. Uh, Daniel Jones got the bag, and he showed out, dude. Danny Dimes showed out. Um, change the media York thing? Change win conditions for mediocre. What is it? Six. It's six to four wins. Playoff misses is nine to seven. You don't think? Come on, dude. These guys are at least could get four wins. It sucks so much they're not winning any game. Should I do six to three wins? Six to three wins? <laughs> Should I just... I'll just drop them to suck so much. I think then if I put the Falcons up there, I'm going to put the Bears down there too. Is that fair? I'm going to change that. I, I, I'll put the Falcons and the Bears are the worst teams in the league. We'll see about the Houston Texans with their rookie quarterback. Five plus wins. Okay. All right, fly five plus wins. Okay. All right, the New York Giants. The New York Giants did really good, but I think they're playoff hopefuls again. Me personally, I feel like uh, the Giants are playoff hopefuls. Jacksonville Jaguars. I think they make a push this year. I think they're winning the division. And they'll make it to the playoffs. Again. Detroit Lions. This is their time. If you're a Detroit Lion fan. This is your time. Detroit Lions. This is your time. You're taking the North. You're taking uh, the NFC North. And you're going to go to the playoffs, the Detroit Lions. With Matt, uh, Matt Campbell as the head coach, you guys are going to the playoffs. Okay? Green Bay Packers. Aaron Rodgers is gone. We have no, no idea how Jordan Love is going to be. Mediocre. That's how I feel. No Aaron Rodgers. We don't know how Jordan Love is going to play. They're going to be uh, get at most five wins. Same thing with the Carolina Panthers with the rookie quarterback. Um, did, who'd they get? I forget. Let me see. They got... Uh, uh, excuse me. Oh, yeah, they got Bryce Young. With the rookie quarterback, they'll get at least five wins, maybe. New England Patriots. At most, nine wins, but they missed the playoffs. Las Vegas Raiders. Same thing. Jimmy Garoppolo is their starting quarterback here. What? Why are you filming? Yo! Yo! Bro, you got robbed. Bruh, bruh, it gets worse. Oh my god. I'm watching a stream, but look at the 
is empty tackle. Yo, Kel, you got robbed, bro. Okay, okay, back back to the L uh, Las Vegas Raiders. Same thing. Taco plain as fuck. You got a taco shell. Las Vegas Raiders, they missed the playoffs. The LA Rams, dude. This is a tough one, man. The LA Rams is a tough one because two years ago they won the Super Bowl, right? Two years ago they won the Super Bowl and then last year they only get three wins or five wins. I don't know what happened. They're not mediocre. They're super good team, but they missed the playoffs. They're not mediocre. Set. All right. The Baltimore Ravens. They make a playoff push. Well, what happened to the Rams? What happened to the Rams? All right, the New Orleans Saints. Uh, they were bad last season too. Let's check them out. All the whole NFC South is sucks. Oh, Derek Carr. Derek Carr is their starting quarterback. I forgot. I think with the NFC South being so bad. They get nine wins, but they make the playoffs with Derek Carr. I don't I think they make it to the playoffs. Okay. Alright, alright, that's what her ass gets. That's that's what her ass gets. Seattle Seahawks. They make that playoff push again. Seattle Seahawks make that playoff push again. Pittsburgh Steelers. This is a good one. With Cincinnati, Baltimore, Pittsburgh Steelers. Um can Kenny Pickett do it? I think I think they could sneak in, dude. I I think the Pittsburgh Steelers could do it. Mike Tomlin is a great head coach, Hall of Fame head coach. I think he gets it done, bro. I think they could get it done and they could sneak into the playoffs. I feel like the Saints as well. I'm gonna move the Saints up. Now it's because, look, Cincinnati's a great team, dude. Uh, Joe Burrow's hurt right now. They're going to lose a bunch of games, dude. I think without Joe Burrow, they, they, lose, they lose at least three games without Joe Burrow on the field. And that that's just going to bump up Baltimore and the Pittsburgh Steelers, I feel like. So I'm going to keep uh, the Bengals missing the playoffs. Okay, but if Joe Burrow was staying healthy, easily appear. But that's not the case. The Houston Texans with their new uh, uh, Bryce Bryce Young, is it Bryce Young or is it Texans? 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 Right here. Dev Charter. CJ Stroud. CJ Stroud. They get five wins. Tennessee Titans. They just got DeAndre Hopkins, bro. They just got DeAndre Hopkins. Ryan Tannehill is probably becoming good, maybe coming back. They still have Derrick Henry, the king. 
they can make it to the playoffs, dude. Tennessee Titans are playoff hopefuls. Last but not least, the Minnesota Vikings. I feel like they fall. I feel like they're going to miss the playoffs and they're only going to get nine wins. Um, no, they're actually pretty good, Kel. But yeah, guys, this is my um, NFL football prediction. Um, if you're any of these teams fans, man, tell me how you feel down in the comment section below. Um, yeah, this is, uh, this is pretty cool. This is my early football prediction. Uh, this is how my, um, uh, we all know how the season's going to play out though. Miami Dolphins are winning the Super Bowl. That is it. Um, but yeah, guys, if you are new here, make sure you smash that sub button, like the video, share the video. Yeah, only two teams really suck is the Falcons and the Bears. Rest of this, we'll see uh, mid-season. I'll see you guys mid-season uh, with, uh, with how the season's panning out. All right, thank you guys so much. All right, fire video, Kel.